We would like to take six minutes to show you a new concept in performance verification of multi-channel dispensing devices, such as automated liquid handling instrumentation. What if you could always be assured that your instrumentation was working to specification in a fraction of the time required by conventional verification methods? What would this do for the integrity of your data? Moreover, what would this do for your laboratory productivity, for the quality of your output, the consistency of your processes, and if you are in a regulated environment, for your GMP, GLP compliance. The RTEL MVS can answer these needs by combining proven scientific principles with an understanding of the challenges faced by users of liquid handling equipment. RTEL has developed a system which provides measurement precision, accuracy, and speed well in excess of what can be achieved with conventional methods of performance verification. As well, we've made the procedure very easy to run and have added the benefit of measurement traceability. Here are three of the many ways in which MVS can help your lab's productivity and compliance. You need to transfer a method. In scaling up, the method's volumes will be dispensed by different programs, different devices, or in a different lab. You need to be sure that the volume delivered by the liquid handling equipment, when scaled up, is consistent with the volume delivery as it was being developed. The NIST traceable data from an NVS in one location using one program, device, or laboratory can be compared with confidence to the data from another location also employing the MVS. Hence, scale-up can proceed with many fewer unknown variables to contend with, regardless of location. You are setting up your liquid handling instrumentation for a new application, and your assay results do not correlate well with those obtained during development. Your troubleshooting points towards erratic or inaccurate liquid delivery. You need a means of determining quickly and accurately where the trouble lies. The MVS gives you the ability to do quick volume checks before and after a delivery. This quick diagnosis will provide you with maximum productivity and allow you to meet aggressive schedules with minimized waste. You would like to gain more confidence in the performance of your liquid handler. You have scheduled periodic calibration by the factory service technicians. Their service visit is semi-annual and the liquid volumes you use are not checked during the service calibration. The MVS can be employed to show dispense trending patterns of the liquid handler between preventive maintenance calibration intervals. The MVS can also be used to measure performance of the instrument before and after the manufacturer's service ensuring dispense repeatability even after changes to the system have been made as part of the maintenance or calibration procedure. These three situations, ensuring repeatability, diagnosing unacceptable performance, and measuring performance between calibrations, show how easily and effective the MVS can be in helping you get the most out of your liquid handling instrumentation. Now we will review the technology behind the MVS. The MVS is a complete mobile system composed of the following parts. Characterized verification plates, sample solutions, diluent solution, baseline solution, the NIST traceable calibrator plate, the titer plate shaker, a notebook computer equipped with data manager software, a barcode reader, and the plate reader. The scientific foundation for the MVS is the Beer Lambert Law, which states that transmission of light through a liquid is directly related to the optical density of the liquid. Absorbance photometry is the basis for myriad analytical systems in use in laboratories. In its simplest form, it is also the foundation for some of the methods traditionally used to verify liquid delivery performance of both manual pipettes and automated liquid delivery instruments. The MVS uses two dyes, each with a separate absorbance spectrum. MVS sample solutions contain both red and blue dye. Different concentrations of red dye are used in the sample solutions to accommodate a range of volume deliveries from 100 nanoliters to 200 microliters. MVS diluent solution contains only blue dye. Sample solution is added to the diluent solution. Then, ratiometric calculations are used to individually determine the volume dispensed from each individual channel into each well of a microtiter plate. This ratiometric process enables a degree of performance measurement not possible with just one die and one wavelength. Performance data can be acquired for liquid handlers composed of 1, 2, 4, 8, 12, or 96 individual dispensing channels. Let's now review the procedural steps and performance of the MVS. 
Start the system using the MVS icon on the desktop. The software provides for 21 CFR Part 11 compliance. Using the calibrator plate, extend traceability to the plate reader by calibrating at the beginning of each day. The plate is scanned with the barcode reader. In less than one minute, the plate reader will be calibrated. The calibrator plate ensures the plate reader is normalized to the NIST traceable standards and provides accurate and repeatable MVS results. Following the plate reader calibration, dispense baseline solution into a verification plate and read the plate reader. The baseline solution provides an optical zero reading and allows the system to remove optical artifacts, such as light scatter, from affecting the volume measurement process. Next, design your plate layout to support your planned testing. Scan the proper barcodes on the sample solution and the diluent bottle. Use a verification plate for a true volume measurement that is traceable to NIST. Alternatively, optically clear, flat-bottom microtiter plates may also be used once they are added to the plate library. Fill each well of the verification plate using MVS diluent solution. The diluent serves as an internal standard by which the path length within each well is individually measured. Dispense the desired volume of sample solution into each well containing the diluent. The sample solution can be added before or after the MVS diluent solution, allowing simulation of your assay's dispense methodology. Cover the plate and place it securely on the plate shaker. The system controls the plate shaker speed and duration. When the plate has been read, the volume results are immediately displayed on the screen in a per well and per channel report. This report can be titled and exported for further analysis and printed. The database also allows data to be recalled for later analysis or compliance reporting. The MVS is becoming the standard for performance verification of liquid handling instrumentation and is in use at numerous laboratories worldwide. Leaders in life science laboratories are using the MVS to improve their productivity, enhance regulatory compliance, and ensure data integrity.